guys, welcome to the vlog. We are going out to Panto very shortly, but first I've got to get Noah. Um, and then we're gonna go and we're gonna have an absolutely brilliant, brilliant evening. Guys, we are on our way to Panto now. We can't wait. It's gonna be really, really awesome. I think, what are we actually seeing? Robin Hood. Robin Hood. Robin Hood. So um, we're looking forward to it. It's gonna be really good. So um, yeah, you guys are gonna love this theater. You good? Panto. Getting ready for Panto, guys. We're going to right now. We're not going to the right level. We're going down. I thought we were going down. No, we're going to Primark. See no one. What is it? Does this look good? It does look good, doesn't it? Higher. Look higher. Higher. Good, isn't it? And look at that. Are you having your food? Are we waiting for your food to come? Did you come or did no, don't, no, we didn't. Do I don't think last I came year. last year, so it should be good. Oh, the most boring trees you've ever seen. Where Robin Hood lives. Have we? Yeah. Uh, hey, look at this place. Front row, guys, front row. I thought we were going to be at the back. Wow. Oh, there. So good. You're in theatre. Right. Hi. Hi, look, we're so close. Hello, Hello. Amazing, it's so good. The kids are having a great time. The panto is awesome. I'm sorry I can't film the show because of obviously copyright and everything, but uh, it's really good. How big is this place? Isn't it massive? Yeah. Shane Ritchie from EastEnders, Alfie Moon, he got Cheryl with her squirty thing, they got her right in the hair, check out her hair, look at it. Well done. Yeah. You got done by Shane Ritchie. I did get done by Shane Ritchie. Having fun at Panto. Is it good? It's not good. Do you like Robin Hood? What about that big dinosaur? Is it scary? Is that scary? <laughs> what about all that smoke when it comes on? We are having such fun as a family, it's amazing. It's She says no. Here we go. <laughs> 
Guys, that was amazing. Panto's awesome. What do you think of it, though? Amazing. That theatre is huge, it. guys. I wish I could have filmed in there, but I just... And I got this. Even Richie was funny. I couldn't film in there. It's so annoying because of copyright and everything. They tell us to turn our cameras off, but we had such a blast. Did we pick Mummy up? He was good. Has he been in something before? I've seen him before. Oh, what's his name? I'm not sure. I've, I've seen him brown. before. He's brown. He looks like he's brown. That's what you wonder, doesn't it? So I thought it was um, it was really good. We thoroughly enjoyed that. It was an amazing show, and I highly recommend that you guys all go to theatre with your kids and stuff as well. Just do stuff as a family, man. It's really good. So we are heading home now to. Um, Enjoy our evening in front of the um, box, I think. I don't know. Did you have lots of fun? She keeps saying no. Every time I ask her, did you have fun? She says, no. <laughs> she did, though. I remember one time you did that and you couldn't reach it and then the barrier wouldn't carve. <laughs> Yeah, so this magician had like an empty cage and he did this thing, he had like this um, hanky or whatever it was and he just flicked it in the air and then this like bird appeared, I was like what? Like that, that was just mad. One time he had a ball, he had this little, little plastic ball and he, I don't know what he did with his hand, he just like opened his hand and went... There was a bit of paper, he scratched up through it in the air and it was a bouncy ball. Amazing. Simply, magicians just amaze, amaze me beyond words. Guys, I hope you guys at home have um, had so much fun today as well. I mean, I, I spent most of my day at work and doing stuff like that, but the work stuff is like not important to me. Well, it is, but what I mean is it's boring for you guys to watch me at work all the time, so I don't do too much in a way of like work vlogs now. Coming up to uh, Ham Roll Central. Ham Roll. Oh, look what it is, Owen. It's your little house. Owen's favourite place. See no, see no. If I did, I would be in there buying a brand new work van. Yeah. It would be so amazing. Or a new car, a new family car, look. Uh, petrol station. So we are back now and it's time to get you guys ready for bed. You've got one more day of school, literally one more one day. day. And then it's the weekend and you got three or four more days next week. Three. What day did you break up? Yeah. Wednesday? This Thursday. Thursday, next Thursday. Thursday? Next week, yeah. Okay, cool. So you've got four days after this weekend. Hi buddy, you going to bed too? Yeah, we did! In the lift? In the lift? You like that? Everybody saw the lift. Yeah. You weren't scared in the lift, it was a big lift and you weren't scared were you? Oh, that was yeah. Cheeky. I was scared! Was you hard. were scared, no you weren't, you weren't scared in the lift, you were a big brave girl. I you were just, not. You were just scared of that T-Rex. I was by the glass. You were scared of the T Rex in the I love the 3D bit and the Oh, the 3D glasses, how good are they? Did you see? They gave us these 3D glasses. So cool! 3D glasses, like you Amazing! Look 3D. Like 3D, ho 3D Holly coming at you. <laughs> 3D Harvey coming at you. 3D Daddy coming at you. No, these um, 3D glasses were amazing. I love the way they do that, they break up the panto by putting these little 3D clips in halfway through, it's amazing. Harvey, you scream like a girl. <laughs> it was a You guys got to get a drink. You got to get. To... It was. Was it you? No, it's me. <laughs> you both sound the same. That's why I was going. Guys, I need you to get ready for bed because you're going to be tired for school. It's ten thirty in the evening now. You're up very late on school night because you've had fun and been to Panto and. And I'm tired. And you're like a cockerel now. A rooster, a chicken. Rooster's tired. Right, Harvey. Harvey, pajamas. Drink. Bed. Woo.
Guys, as you can tell by our faces, we are absolutely drained. It doesn't look like we've done much today, but I can assure you we have. We did all the normal stuff. She did the school runs, because she is amazing, and I did work and stuff. And then we've been to Panto, and it's been a really, really long evening. I haven't just done that. You've done loads today. You've been in a hospital. I did a very, yeah, a pointless hospital run. So you went to the hospital. they muddled up the appointments. She had an appointment. She went to the hospital, waited mm. for over an hour and a half, and then they turned and said, oh, you're not on our records. You shouldn't be here today. And we're just like, oh, OK. Yeah, after they, when, you know, they wrote to me a week or so ago, cancelling the original appointment for today to then be told they've written the letter but forgotten to book us in on the system. It's just really, really bad. It's not good, you know. But, I mean, I can't knock the NHS because it's one of the most godsend services. I mean, we'd be screwed without it, to be honest, because I think most of this country would be pretty screwed without the NHS. So they are amazing. Yeah. And they saved your life from two or three times, so... Yeah, they have, literally. Absolutely amazing NHS, actually. I'm, I'm actually praising the NHS right now. You guys save lives, and you are incredibly amazing, and we are so, so grateful to have you guys in the UK... National Health Service guys, they are the best. But for now, oh my poor baby, poor the eyes. Yeah, she's got a bit of contractivitis. Oh, she's so sweet, you poor little girl. <laughs> Should we wrap this up? Because we're knackered, aren't we? I mean, tired. I wouldn't say that word. It's naughty. We are very, very tired. It has been a super long day. But the theatre was amazing. The whole thing today was like going to the theatre with the kids. They've been so excited about seeing Robin Hood and it was amazing. Shane Ritchie from EastEnders, such a funny, funny guy. And um, the whole cast and crew were amazing. It was fantastic. And as I said earlier in the vlog, I highly recommend that you guys go with your family and your kids and everything. You will have an absolutely brilliant time. You did have a good time, didn't you, sweetheart? She loved it. Oh, she's like, I can see myself. <laughs> guys i'm wrapping it up there for today um thanks for coming oh. along as always you are truly truly amazing people we can't thank you enough we say it a lot because it's the truth and it comes from our heart we truly truly appreciate you guys coming along every single day it means so much to us and we're trying so so hard to keep the daily runs going to get stuff out here and just to give you guys a little taster of what we do every single day even if it's just going to the shops or just going to the theatre or just going to a football match or just doing something called put or just flipping my lip don't flip my lip again right or just putting up a Christmas tree or just choose a cheeky one this one so let's wrap it up babe guys we will see you tomorrow for 20 20 20 for number twenty, <laughs> number twenty-four in a row. Right, guys. See you later. Peace out. <laughs>